You're watching North Alabama's News Leader. This is News 19 at 4. Today, the Cobber County Sheriff's Office held a safe high school ahead of the start of the new school year. As News 19, Whitney White Leibold shows us, the training was all to help make sure their new safety program, program is keeping students safe. We do want to warn you, some of the video you're about to see is from the training, and it's just a simulation. In a situation like this one, it's all hands on deck for law enforcement. On Monday, Colbert County Sheriff's Office held a school safety training to prepare for keeping students safe this year before they head back to school and to practice with the school's new $2 million safety platform called Inside. They can access each of their camera feeds through the platform. They can access that emergency operations plan. They know exactly where people need to be, how to respond, exactly what to do in those moments. Um, but not only that, we also have 360 degree images inside and outside of the buildings in every classroom and every Closet. Sheriff Eric Ballantyne told News 19 that each student resource officer on campus also learned what they should do in a certain situation while waiting for backup. And this year, officers will be on the lookout. So going into this school year, everybody has an SRO. So every school's got someone on hand. There were two scenarios that the sheriff's office went through. A hostage situation where it ended with no injuries and then a full active shooter training. Where we did have casualties and injured students, uh, we made entry, we neutralized the threat, he was deceased, and uh, we let medical come in, do a triage, we have a reunification point set up so that parents know that when we have a situation like this, it's important not to come to the scene. This is the very first year that Colbert County has this new safety feature and students will head back to the classroom Wednesday, August 7th. In Colbert County, Whitney Leibold, News 19.